חג שמח. 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 חג We have all the senior staff and the administrative staff and the school staff all with us tonight to celebrate Hanukkah. So welcome everybody. And we're gonna get started singing. Um, is it Cantor David or Cantor, Cantor Sarah? Welcoming everybody, how good it is to be here all together. pleasant it is we've all joined together this is the last night of Hanukkah the last day number eight Calliope's got the menorah holding it showing eight lit lights and Arya's got eight fingers up oh yeah and who ate latkes and sukkario today I ate soup karyot. I did too. So eight is a special number. Eight is a holy number. Eight is the number of days in creation. Wrong. Not really. That was seven. But this is eight because it's Hanukkah and it's a miracle. And we're here to celebrate. And I'm glad to introduce my dear friend, Steve, my neighbor, Steve. What is it? Alan, right. Oh, no, thank you. Steve Allen, because he he takes care of all of the staff that's on here tonight. So Steve, welcome, say hi to everybody. Thank you, welcome. Thank you, Rabbi. Hello, everybody. It is so good to see all of you. Um, I didn't make it mandatory for the staff to come, but it was really great to see you all here. It's wonderful. Um, I know the, that even though it is the last night of Hanukkah and when that last light burns out, we don't burn out as a staff. We keep the light going. We, we will always, like Rabbi Keller said, day nine and 10 and 11 and 12 and going forward. Um, no, they can't come to my house, but, but we, <laughs> um, it is just, it's, it's, it's very heartwarming yeah. to see everybody. It is an amazing feeling. And, and I thank all of you Um, and I, all, the, all the members that are on who've come to support the staff tonight, I thank you, I bless you. I think it's just great. It really, it truly is, you know, speaking on behalf of everyone, um, it's an honor to be part of this staff and it's just, it is just beautiful. And we will, I promise you, we will keep those lights going even when the last one tonight flickers out. Did you know the Beatles wrote about Hanukkah? Eight days a week, I light the menorah. Eight days a week, I eat jelly donuts and latkes and light the menorah. That's it, Beatles wrote that. Yeah, 
Okay. All right. Thanks, Steve. That's uh, one way to sing it. <laughs> you could sing it better. But now we're going to turn it over to Rabbi Cohn. She's got a big bucket in front of her, it looks like. And I bet she's going to use that to teach us something about this last day and night of Hanukkah. Rabbi Cohn. Thank you, Rabbi. Hi, everyone. We often say that Hanukkah is a holiday about miracles. And this is true, but I believe it is also a story about faith. The Maccabees knew they had only enough sanctified oil for one night, for one light. They could have said, it's not enough. We need oil for eight nights. Why even bother? It's over already. We already lost. But they didn't do that. Having in their hands only an eighth of what they needed for the task, they nonetheless lit the oil. They put their faith in God's providence and took the brave first step. So after that first night, they prayed to God, please let there be more oil in our little jar, our little jug of oil. And lo and behold, there was more oil. And the second night came and it got dark and cold. And what were they going to do? They needed more oil, but their little jar, they didn't think there would be enough oil. But the third night they prayed, please God, let there be enough oil. And there was more oil. Oh my God, they were so thankful. And the fourth night came and they did the same thing. Join me, say it with me, please God, let there be enough oil. <laughs> and there was oil, they just couldn't believe it. The fifth night came and of course they did the same thing. They prayed and prayed and there was more oil. They were so thankful to God. They praised God and they had so much faith. So that sixth night came and surely that little jar of oil, there could not be any more oil in there, but there was more. And again, on the seventh night, there was more. And finally, the week had passed. And on the eighth night, they didn't. It's time to let the oil rest. Any oil left. But they had faith and they prayed, please let there be enough oil. And there was. <laughs> From the view of the sages, the very moment when the Maccabees suspended all doubt and strengthened their faith and took action, despite all odds, it, that was when the real miracle happened. Having faith does not mean becoming reckless or choosing not to exercise good judgment. It is about recognizing that sometimes, even when we can't see the whole picture, and appear to lack what's needed to complete any mission that we have, we still take that step forward in the right direction. Although we are at our last night of Hanukkah, I pray that its message carries us through. Even when our strength is running low, like the oil, and we feel like we're running low and don't have any more in us, may we continue to have the faith that we need. We're going to continue with our Hanukkah. That's your koach, Rabbi. <laughs> Thank you. Rabbi, I just have a question. Did they ever check to see if there was any oil left after eight days, if they wanted to run for, you know, use the same jar for the a no, night? No, Rabbi, I don't think they did, but they probably should have. Wait, what are you doing? <laughs> That's the best. <laughs> wow. Everyone grabs your Hanukkah menorah, your Hanukkah, and go ahead and get ready to light your shamash. Eyes in the window.
All right, everyone, join me. Baruch Atah Adonai Eloheinu Melech HaOlam Asher Kiddushanu B'mitzvotav V'tzivanu Lehadlik Ne'er Baruch Atah Adonai Eloheinu Melech HaOlam She'asa Nisim Lavoteinu Bayamim Ha'em Bazman Hazeh Amen. Okay, who's ready for a Hanukkah sing-along? Yeah. All the words are on the screen, and I'm hoping that I say them all right. So you guys have to help me. Ready, guys? Can you see those? Where's the Yiddish? <laughs> well, I'm going to work on that for next year. I'm going to take, my dad and I are going to take a Yiddish class this year in 2021. So I owe you some Yiddish next year. Okay, ready, guys? <laughs> Happy Hanukkah, everybody. Happy Hanukkah, everybody. Happy Hanukkah, everybody. Thank you, Hanukkah. Happy 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 Yes. Okay. Here's my hello happy, teacher. Happy Hanukkah. Oh, my teacher. My teacher. Happy Ms. Hanukkah. Hi, Miss Wendy. Happy Hanukkah, everybody. Happy Don't forget. Hanukkah. Hanukkah. Happy Don't forget Hanukkah. tomorrow is still Hanukkah all day. So all day. you get to happy. All, day. 
all day. Where's Miss Rachel? Don't forget, it's Monica okay, yeah. all day. Where's Ask Ms. for Rachel? more gifts, JC. Ask for more gifts and eat lots of latkes. Where's Miss Rachel? You still have latkes? <laughs> Hi, for the kids. Oh, He's God. hiding, <laughs> Rabbi Silvers. Hi. <laughs> Everyone looks so nice. <laughs> Robin. <laughs> no one wants to get off because it's oh, like you don't <laughs> see them. Yeah, oh, oh, there's Rachel oh. Allen. I just saw her. Yeah. <laughs> Good nice night, everybody. Good night, everyone. Good night. Well, Good night. Good night. Good night. Celebrating Hanukkah. Oh, oh, oh. I see Miss Rachel waving at me. Hi, Rachel. Oh, 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 oh. That was Keller's fault. Who's staring? I tell you, this is a good holiday. I love Hanukkah. That's I love you, Richie. Hi, Miss Allison. Hi, Rabbi Keller. Hi, Miss Linda. Hi, Favivi. Did you see Favivi got braces? Favivi got braces again. I see. Oh, I want to show everybody my 40 year old dreidel. Oh, Janet, hold that's beautiful. So we could see yeah. it. Janet, hold it up a little more. There you oh, go. So oh, that's beautiful. Wow. Very nice, Janet. Nice. Love Hi, it. Pop. Hug some air. Hug some air. Bye, everybody. Hug some air. Happy Hanukkah.